All right, we're at the, is this Doan Valley uh, campground parking? Great parking uh, and- Palomar Mountain State Park. Another Palomar Mountain State Park. We're gonna get, uh, this is November 7, Delta Alpha, Drew, and uh, and one CLC. We're gonna head up to Gordon Point. So pretty country in here, very, it's, uh, it's really nice and sunny. It's all green. But uh, what is it about? It's gotta be over 40 degrees. Yeah, it's like 50 degrees now. It's warmer. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, I was expecting 45, so this is a bonus. Yeah, let's, so let's head out. CQ, CQ, CQ. This is November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. Summer time here. Pretty little road here. And they dig 12 inches or something, right? Do snow to get to it. But here are the birds. Put them in that woodpecker hole to I'll be start the winter. A lot yeah, easier for them to get to their food than if it's under four feet of snow. Yeah, I've never seen that before. So all the way up the tree, it's packed with acorns into those woodpecker holes and cracks and stuff as well. Those big long cracks in the bark. My shadow out. Uh, just kind of a nice view from up here and uh, we're heading over to that little point there small saddle between us so I think you said 200 foot gain over there 200 foot of saddle yeah yeah so easy peasy road up we didn't bring the bikes um, my bad yeah we're gonna bring anything really that goes wrong it's it's a it's a drew <laughs> but we'll get the right summit designator to start with <sighs> but uh, yeah, peaceful hike so far. That's pretty. It's nice to be enough in the actual forest. It's yeah. Good. It's Not nice in here. It's certainly a beautiful hike so far. Um, mountain bikeable for me. A little uh, water hazard here. Did I see action shots? Darn. I was hoping you'd go in. <laughs> that would make a much better. That make a much better thumbnail. Yeah. I'll put the chart up here, but this is the intersection. Uh, with the other road that goes across here, so we'll be making a left. So, beautiful hike to date. And, uh, yeah, pretty country. Some big darn pines in here. Nice that this hasn't uh, burned down. What time we got on the 9.30? I didn't roll out of bed too early. I think my drive was about an hour and 15 to get here. That was after, after the gas up, and then I went flying by a turn. The whole point of this is to have fun, yeah? <laughs> <Fair> <laughs> that thing's huge. Need a bow finger scale. Yeah, <laughs> I think your head is good enough. Although you got a pretty, you got a pretty big noggin, I you know. I see. All right. <laughs> Those are some beauties. <laughs> Directing now. <laughs> I need to be running faster. <laughs> okay, so do you have a battery that works today? I hope so. <laughs> it's brand well, new. It's been analyzed. <laughs> much, much better than the failed pack. What'd you bring? So I should be good to go. But I brought the KX3. With what battery? Off the shelf Energizer 2300 nickel metal hydrates. Okay, sweet. And the internal resistance is where it should be. So these ought to work pretty good. All right, well, I got backup. On the road here. We got uh, San Gorgonio to the far left, then to the right, San Jacinto, and then the foreground is uh, Kahui or Kuhuya. Then over to uh, Thomas Mountain, and ranging around, uh, we've got Combs Peak and uh, Hot Springs Mountain and stuff over here to the right. So beautiful view of all these soda summits that uh, I've been on, actually all of those. So good times, beautiful view from up here. And just a little bit farther to go, we're pretty much almost in the, the summit.
Okay, that may have been the longest antenna setup. Got lazy and then it was kind of a shit show. But, what happens when you're lazy? Put the radio up and see if we can get some contacts. I don't know how optimal this is, but. Not real happy with it. I'm using the uh, LNR NFED. Give me some options on where I'm going to go, but it also has its pain points. So, uh, part of it is just, it's bigger. It's a, it's a much longer antenna, which is, can be a good thing. But for screwing around out in the forest, maybe not the best. But we're out in the forest, so you can't friggin' beat that. Pull the cover off. Let's get some power. I don't need, I don't have to have this power, but I'm super lazy and it's so much easier to pull off this guy and do a bunch of activations on one charge. Kind of a slow day up here. Not, that DX Not a lot of DX. Slow. I'm running a slightly different uh, setup. Okay, you've got a. Uh, what are you running here? KX3. Wires. KX3 with a wire. And. Uh, I brought nine to one transformer and a one to one transformer. Oh, there you go. Trying the one to one transformer was not loading up as well as I expect, so I'm not sure mm. what's going on there. So, fooling with that for a minute. Cool. You got nine to one random wire, or no, I'll use that for uh, half wave end feds. Okay. So, the uh, Brought a microphone, I don't know if I'll use that. I've got my QRP guys single lever paddle, but I brought this guy just because I like the action on it so much. Cool. Uh, anyways, I'll right. get something loaded up for 20 and uh, jump on 20. Cool. We'll get her done, man. Yeah. N1CLC, this is N3XUL. And 3XUL, how's it going, man? Uh, not that I want to make it, uh, make it official complete here. You guys did all the hard work for me today. Oh, yeah, no problemo. Uh, good hike. And uh, kind of slow on the HF bands, but not bad. Okay, roger that. You, uh, you make a lot of QSOs up there. Yeah, looks like I got about uh, 15 in the bag for Summit to Summit so far. Oh, roger that. You guys head down the hill and then. I'm gonna, I just started, I just spotted on uh, uh, two meters, so I'm going to see how that goes. All right, yeah, you sound great here. Um, I put uh, I put up my Yagi just in case. I wanted to make sure I could grab you. Yeah, well, that's a complete for both of us now. 
Yeah, that's uh, for sure. So there you go. Um, I'll go ahead and uh, put it in the log and uh, mark you down as my uh, favorite soda operator of the day. <laughs> Okay, Roger, Roger. Thanks for the call, man. And uh, catch you next time. November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. Summit's on the air for any station anywhere. CQ, 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 CQ Soda, November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. Summit's on the air, any station, anywhere. K6ARK. K6ARK, I recognize that call sign. How's it going, Adam? Yeah, QSL, QSL. Thanks, Adam, and uh, have a good one. All right, one more time. Signal report, please. I got you at about a, a five, 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 five. Roger, Roger. All right, Chris. November one station. This is Whiskey Six Mike Delta Echo. Hey, Chris, was N three XUL on a summit or was he at his home? Uh, he's at his home, uh, J uh, John. Whiskey 6, Mike Delta Echo, got you 5-9. You're a 5-7, five, 5-7 seven, five, seven here in Ukaipa. What peak are you on? Uh, we're on Gordon Point. That's uh, Charlie Tango 102. Copy that, Gordon's Point, Charlie Tango 102. Uh, 73s and good luck on your activation. Roger, Roger, thanks for the contact. This is November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie Summit's on the air. WNI and SSN, another contact. Thanks, Gustav. I got you 5-9 on the summit. Uh, Roger, the 5-9. I've got you uh, about a 5-7 into Point Loma. I must have just missed you. I was up on Iron Mountain earlier this morning, but uh, drove back, got home about uh, 30 minutes ago. Ah, uh, bummer, yeah. We got up here a little bit later, just kind of been kicking back and uh, doing some exploring, trying to figure out how to get, if we could get to the actual summit, but a little too overgrown for that. Roger that. Well, uh, enjoy the rest of the day. 7-3, Happy New Year. Yeah, same to you. Thanks for the contact. November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie. Summit's on the air. Station calling uh, Soda Summit. Call again. 6 Romeo, do you copy? 6 Romeo, uh, call again. It's November Golf 6 Romeo. November Golf 6 Romeo, got you 5-5. Five, five. Okay, Chris, thanks a lot for the activation. <clears throat> you are uh, here in the Palace Birdies, over. QSL, QSL, thanks, Jerry. Okay, Chris, uh, take care. 73, happy, happy New Year, NG6 on. 73, happy New Year. This is November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie Summit's on the air. All right. Let's see if we can wrestle up on HF. We'll get a few more, then we'll head out. Hmm. Wind's picking up. Kind of chills you down. Go up here and find my station. Oh yeah, my little little uh, strap here on the shoulder. These are pretty nice. I got it off the, uh, Amazon. Uh, I bought this after losing a radio. Oh, also on, on uh, Poser. No, mine's oh, on Poser. <laughs> Poser, and it's in a ravine somewhere. How much where... of a bushwhack is Poser, by the way? Since you're just well, there's a good bushwhack. I just did that a few days ago. Yeah. But the first time I did it, I came down the ravine. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, yeah, you said. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's where the radio is somewhere. Because I had to backtrack and go up and then back. Yeah, it was, yeah, a mess. Anyway, um, I think I got 30, 31 contacts and four summit to summits on uh, right work 10, 20, and 40. And I uh, tried to work 17, tried to get uh, Charlie on 17, but couldn't do it. Um, there you go. Oh. Count those up. Lighting. <laughs> yeah, count those up and... Uh, oh. There we go. And that's, that's what uh, Drew is coming away with. You got a few summits, summits I see on there. Yeah. A couple awesome. guys uh, jumped out and called me when uh, I was calling. And so they, they saw me spot and, and worked me, so... Yeah. Awesome. KX0R, uh, one of them? Yep, and uh, the other was, was it? Oh, W7UM, yep. Oh, so, cool. I don't no, think no I got call him. Signs. Yeah. yeah, I didn't get him, but I got uh, TOA. Yeah, 
yeah, I, I just heard the weak uh, S2S and it's like, oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> we'll work you. I yeah. Hear you. Yeah, and I chased. I chased a couple, I think, and got some stuff to summit. So, yeah, good uh, good time up here. Beautiful weather. It's going to be snowing here in a couple days, so that may close this out. Oh, yeah. There's a there's the observatory right over there. O only a 200 inch telescope. This is a little baby. Yeah, small one. Is that the fire tower on the high point uh, to the left? Well, yeah, there's one way back. Yeah. I mean, oh, that's, there's that's the high point that there. would be the high Looks point. Like the fire, is that the fire terror there? Must yeah, be. yeah, it must be. Anyway, we're gonna head down the hill here and uh, make our way back to the vehicles. <laughs> oh, that's a lot simpler when you take your pack off. Yeah, dang it. I wasn't like hung up for we a missed... half hour, <laughs> like a turtle on its back. Yeah, we missed the good video on the way in. Too bad that and the stream splash. Yeah. Oh, this is a really pretty hike. Highly recommend it. Do you agree? Yes, very much. A lot of fallen oak leaves here. Makes it very picturesque. Um, we're pretty close to the cars. Probably another 10 minutes or so, but uh, if you're interested in doing this hobby, you can go out and check. Uh, I, I built a series called Soda 360. And it talks about the planning, which uh, most most uh, operators don't cover in their videos. And then an, uh, an example activation and how to upload your logs and stuff. There's some deep dives in a, into a couple of things. Uh, one of them being chasing, specifically for chasers. And another one on charting using all, uh, all trails. Um, I'm using Gaia now, which so I might have to do a deep dive on that. but. So, there you go. If you're interested in doing that, check out those videos if you're interested in learning about it. And so that's about it. So thank you very much for all the chasers and activators out there. A lot of fun today. Thanks for watching. Um, if you want to push the like and subscribe, you gotta do that, right, Drew? Pound it. <laughs> that just makes my ego bigger, but more importantly, I'm, I'm more interested in your comments, actually, so do that. So until next time, guys, 73, we'll roll the credits. <laughs>